Now that you understand the principles about what makes hook points strong, let's look specifically at how to apply their power to the creation of digital content and videos. With more than 60 billion messages sent out on digital platforms each day, hook points are essential tools that help you stand out among the noise and you can use them to more effectively package content for a better chance at having meaningful engagement, a strong viral presence, and growth. In this section, I will also introduce you to the importance of images and visual storytelling tactics that capture and hold attention. Visual storytelling is vital. 59% of senior executives would rather watch a video than read text if they have the option. It's a new phenomenon called the picture superiority effect, where information presented with visuals is learned and remembered more easily than information without. Including an image in your social media post delivers 180% more engagement and increases content retention up to 65%. Use hook points to package your information. Back when I was working with journalist Katie Couric, we interviewed some of the world's biggest celebrities, including Jessica Chastain, Joe Biden, Chance the Rapper, and DJ Khalid, among many others. By testing all this content, I discovered that the popularity of the celebrity at the time had little correlation to how well the content performed. The simple fact that someone is famous doesn't provide enough incentive to get people to stop and pay attention to content in today's world. What truly captures attention is the way information is packaged, presented, and communicated on digital platforms. The topic the celebrity discussed and the way the topic was presented to the audience was often more responsible for the content success than the fact that a celebrity was featured. In other words, leveraging fame wasn't enough. Celebrities needed to be discussing topics that had a strong hook to get audiences to stop scrolling through their feed, watch, and engage. We set out to innovate the standard interview for digital platforms so we could help Kirk's content stand out among the noise. When we first started working together, she had just made the jump from TV to a digital-first distribution partnership with Yahoo!, and the algorithms were not favoring her content. In other words, her content was getting suppressed and wasn't being shown to her fans or the fans of the celebrities she was interviewing. To fix this, we had to completely change the way we produced, edited, and distributed her content across social media. So instead of starting with what questions she would ask in an interview, we focused on what the final output of the interview would look like. More specifically, what were the potential hook points we could generate from the interview that would grab audiences' attention at scale? We designed hooks for each interview based on its appeal to different audiences we felt would not only have an interest in the interview, but also share it with everyone they knew. When Kirk first brought me into meetings with Yahoo!, the executives told me that her content had a very narrow audience. I understood that they wanted to hit that specific demographic to stay relevant and deliver for their current advertisers, but I also knew that if we were going to achieve scale and gain favor with the algorithms, we needed to extend the appeal of her content beyond that audience and do it fast. I knew that the best strategy to achieve this was to identify core advocates for each interview based on the person we were interviewing and or the topic being covered. To accomplish this, we would develop different hooks for each interview designed to statistically increase the chances of getting these core advocates to share the interview with everyone they knew. The idea was that if we could get more people sharing each interview, it would trigger the algorithms to give the content more reach and increase the overall viral potential. In doing so, we were scaling Yahoo's advertiser target audience and opening up Couric's and Yahoo's brand to new audiences at the same time. Effectively, we were getting friends to share with friends, sons and daughters to share with their parents, and siblings to share with siblings. By leveraging hook points, we engineered hitting any audience we desired at scale. The first interview Couric and I tested together was with actress Elizabeth Banks. The interview was structured with three major hook points in mind. Again, we started with the hook points rather than the questions Couric would ask. 